Well, I woke up this morning in Indiana and I'm about to do my first ever Indiana fishing. And I'm not alone. Got Ben over <laughs> here from Hoosier Back Outdoors. Um, we've been wanting to hook up for a while. So finally the day's worked out. The weather's good here. We're gonna get to the creek and hopefully have a good time and hopefully catch some fish. Well, this is not how you want to start your day. <laughs> I was reaching in my bag, uh, grabbing and I found a hook that was loose in there, but look, it's not, it was a new hook and I think I get it out. Ow! Just in the skin there. Stinking barb. There we go. Okay. All right. Good little good creek off a of old country bridge. It's a good start. We're gonna get to some fishing. Go. Hey. Little rock, rocky bass. Ooh, get a little start. That's swarming. My first Indiana fish, right there. Thanks to, thanks to Hoosier Pack. Oh my! Broke my line. It just snapped. First time I got a solid hit. I don't know how. I, I, I didn't even like. I didn't even set the hook on it. I just barely pulled up and it snapped. Well, your line might have been on a rock when it hit. Oh, it, you know? that was a gar. Oh yeah, there's That might have been what hit it. Big spotted gar in here. That might have been what why it broke. That's a good, uh, that's a good explanation there, because I've, they will, they will snap a line pretty quick. Yeah, they will. Never ate one, but. Never tried them. Somebody else said they're real, they're real bony or something. Oh, oh. There we go. <laughs> that's, that's what I want. That's a smallie, I think. Yep. I think that's a smallie. Stay on. Please stay on. Oh. Oh, I'm hungry. Yes, sir. That's what I've been looking for. Nice. Woo! Nice. <laughs> Redemption. <laughs> All right, the Helgramite got it because I lost my white swim bait. So that's a nice little, almost a pound probably. All right, that is a nice Indiana smallmouth. Um, I'm glad I got him after losing one about the size and then breaking my line. Woo! This guy, he's hardcore. Oh, got one. I didn't even know I had him. Oh, nice rock bass. Right off, about to pull it out of there. He's long too. Nice, there we go. Sit on down. Oh. Ah! oh yeah. Yes. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. He's on there, he's on there. That's a solid fish. Got all kinds of trees. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Come on. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Got him. Gorgeous. Nice. I'll take that all day. Okay. Got me in a two or three trees, but he came out. Oh. 
The old Hagemeyer is getting it done again. There's another one in there. I, we haven't come to a spot. Usually, there's going to be a couple, you know. Right. If there's going to be one, I haven't. We haven't really. Oh, oh. Yep. Uh, rock bass. So. Woo! Nice rock bass. Swallowed that thing. My turn. Get you some. He's giving me advantage here. He let me get a head start. He feels sorry for me driving this far. <laughs> Have to get him down there. Get on some Kusa bass. Yeah. Next time we go to Gatlinburg. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> that spot's got some fish in it. Man, that'll work. Nice. <laughs> yep. No, <laughs> dude, that's a fourth fish out of that hole. That, oh, I might have just ruined the Oh, spot. no, no. Got the old snag. Got it. That's a bluegill. Wow. Check out this bluegill. Oh, yeah, that is nice. Pretty one. That was a pretty sunfish. <laughs> All right, we're gonna move on. We moved up to spot number two. We spent about three hours fishing like this uh, horseshoe bend of the creek. Went from one bridge to another bridge. Um, kind of several fish in there, so pretty pumped up to see what we can get out of this next spot and uh, hopefully, hopefully get right back on them. Yeah. Oh, he's a, oh, ooh, ooh, it's a small mouth, I think. Yep, little small mouth. Woo, wee. That's what I'm looking for. Just. Some nice, beautiful little smallmouth there. Went to a little bit bigger swim bait, just, just changing things up. He got that in his mouth pretty easy. Yeah! There we go. Yeah, they're definitely getting more active, I think. The sun's warming up. These fish are like, earlier in the day, we was hardly getting anything. And then all of a sudden, towards, the, towards uh, the end of our last spot, and then all of a sudden now, starting to get a lot of hits. It's got some kind of leech or something on him right there. Pretty, pretty little fish. Yeah, I like this spot right here. I, I love this kind of spots on a creek. Right before it goes down, it's, uh, they always seem to be like, Something holding up back here, just sitting. Oh, oh it came back for it. <laughs> <laughs> How did he come back and get that? Chunky, wait. I think this might be a spotted bass. Yeah, yeah, that's a spotted bass. Real pale, but. Yep. Nice, that's cool. So smallmouth spot, bluegill, and rock bass. Oh, there's a fish up in here. Oh! Had him, little one. Yeah! Good, good, good. Not even that big. Man, it's biting. Yeah, that's not bad. Pretty little fish. Nice.
If I ever need to catch rocks, I know the guy to go to. <laughs> like this dude can catch some rocks. <laughs> You'd be world famous worldwide. Oh, oh, it came off. It came off. That would have been a 16 inch rock. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. I'll take that. Oh, there's no one. Look behind it, behind it. I need it. I need it. All right, yeah. Get him, get him. All right. Oh, that's a nice fish. I'm so happy when I catch one like this size out of a creek. Man, they're so fun. Yeah, they are. Come on. Swallowed that thing. My bait's flashier than his. Beautiful. That's a nice little fish. This place. We found the honey hole here. Oh yeah. They've gotten they've gotten really active. Smacking the swim bait. <laughs> this spot is loaded. He's got the same one over and over. Yeah. <laughs> I just said, hey, go back and bite again. <laughs> we need some film content. Yeah. <laughs> Help me out here. <laughs> Got a big one. Uh, I'm going to make a couple casts up here real quick, and then I'll be back. We'll be ready to go. came off that was a big one i should have set the hook harder i was afraid to set it too hard oh my hook's messed up because i got stuck on that rock big spotty bass my hook was bent from being stuck on a rock and i never it wasn't very sharp man all right we're gonna try again that was a big spotty bass I think the big one, but that's all right. A little small mouth. Man, I, I think I missed that big one, but that happens a lot. Those big creek fish are tough fish to get. All right, well, this wraps up my first ever creek fishing adventure in Indiana, and it went really well. Thanks over here to Ben. Be sure to check out his channel if you haven't already uh, seen it. He does a lot of fishing and sometimes other stuff, but yeah. mainly, mainly fishing. Does a lot of fishing and stuff like that around this area. And, it's about to, it's finally getting warm enough where he'll be doing a lot more of it coming in soon. So thanks so much for him inviting me out. And I just had a great time, caught a bunch of fish. I ended up losing that big one there at the end, but I'm gonna leave that in there cause that's the kind of guy I am. I'm gonna show you the real, real side of fishing. But this awesome, uh, it turned out to be a really good day up to 80 degrees. Small mouth started hitting, rock bass, a little spot and uh, one bluegill. Saw a bunch of long ear sunfish starting to hit there at the end, which didn't really go for them. But thanks so much for watching. Uh, we're probably going to go to another creek, so hopefully I'll make another video from here.